Right now, an Anderson man is facing more than two dozen charges after police say he put hidden cameras in the bathrooms at his home and at work. For years, police say Marcus Deweys exploited women and children by filming them in their most intimate moments. Max Lewis spoke to a woman who says she was recorded and explains how Deweys got caught. According to court documents, Marcus DeWeese was not only viewing child pornography, but was secretly recording people in the bathroom. And several of those alleged victims were people who lived in his own home. Her husband is a monster. A friend of DeWeese's wife says she was a victim herself. She only found out after getting a call from police. There's videos and pictures of me in the bathroom here a couple years ago when I lived here. She was one of 13 victims. Police say Deweese filmed showering, changing, or just using the bathroom. When police served a warrant at his Anderson home, they say they found hidden cameras in the vents and the outlets. He had a number of cameras in bathrooms and bedrooms recording sexual activity and intimate moments of young ladies taking showers. And it didn't stop at his home. Police say DeWeese put hidden cameras in the restroom where he worked. In total, investigators found 140 secretly recorded videos of women in various stages of undress. One of them, police say, was of a teenage girl that DeWeese admitted to filming right outside her bedroom window. You would kill somebody that did this to your daughter, right? So... Why do you think it's okay to do it to anyone else? It all started with a tip from Google after they noticed images containing child pornography were being uploaded to DeWeese's account. Altogether, investigators have found more than 400 images containing child porn, and they're still going through his devices. I'm, I'm pissed. Yeah. <laughs> I know I'm not supposed to say that, but I'm, I, I've never been more angry. I hope he pays for everything he's done. Prosecutor Rodney Cummings said the sad reality is you always have to be aware of your surroundings. You go in a room and you have to be concerned everything is, you know, a camera. It's, it's a pretty awful place that we have to have that mindset, but maybe that's what it's come to. Today, the Madison County Prosecutor's Office filed a motion for a 72-hour extension to file formal criminal charges. Right now, DeWeese is sitting in the Madison County Jail on a $100,000 bond. In Anderson, I'm Max Lewis, Fox 59 News. Max, thank you.